Mellows! Welcome back to Karen Lee's TV. And if you're new to my channel, hi! I'm Karen and I'm back. After, I think, ilang weeks din akong hindi nag-film. Yung last na upload ko before this is pre-film video. Pero matagal na akong hindi nag-film. I think mga 2 weeks na. And for today's video, meron tayong new product na i-review. -re we wear test. And ayun, namiss ko din mag-video. Medyo nag-break lang ako sa filming para parang mag-gain ko lang uli yung aking motivation, yung fire na mag-film. Alam nyo, yung mga araw na hindi ako nag-film as in wala akong gana talaga. So, I don't like naman na mag-upload ng mga half-ass video na parang alam nyo yun. So, yes, I'm back for good. And for today's video is I'm going to review where it is. Actually, Oh, pwede wear test. This is Pretty Secret Oil Control Pore Minimizer Primer. So, ito siya, guys. And, nabili ko to sa Watson's, of course, for 199 pesos. So, ayan siya. And, if you're not familiar, yung Pretty Secret is actually sikat siya sa kanilang mga blotting paper. And, ngayon, dumadami na rin yung kanilang mga products, which mga skincare... And then, meron na rin mga makeup, like lip and cheek tint, and yung parang may bago pa silang cloud tint at ayun. As in, bago lang to, manufacture date is March 30, 2019. Expiration date is March, March 30, 2022. It claims cover up your pores with pretty secret oil control pore minimizer primer. It lessens the appearance of pores and helps control the oil from your face. It gives your skin a matte finish, making your skin look flawlessly bright. So, direction, apply a thin layer on clean face, spread from the center of the face outward with fingertips. For a better finish, wait for a minute and apply makeup. So, nandito yung kanyang ingredients. So, better check that out if you're parang okay ka dyan o baka mamaya may mga pwedeng allergic reactions ka dyan sa mga ingredients na nandito sa product na to. Again, this is 199 pesos. Only one of the affordable na primer na meron dito sa market. Local market natin. And meron siyang 20 ml. So, let's open it up. Actually, madali lang siya i-open. So, ito yung pinaka product and I really, really, really like that packaging. Kita nyo naman. And, para siyang ano pa. Kung titignan nyo, parang, alam nyo, parang benefit yung dating niya. Parang benefit yung colors, di ba? Yung, yung theme. So, it says, Pretty Secret Oil Control Pore Minimizer Primer. I really like the packaging. Gusto ko yung gantong klaseng tube. Ayan, smooth and matte finish. Lessens the appearance of pores, 20 ml. And then, nandito rin sa likod yung kanyang claims, direction, caution, and ingredients. And also, a manufacturing date and expiration date, which is good kung wala nito, meron pa rin to sa product, ba? Kahit at least hindi na nila iganto. Pero syempre, para sure na sure na sealed. So, I think kanyang takip, unscrew lang. And ayan siya. Meron syang mahabang. Medyo i-shake lang natin. And, okay. Ito na siya. Clear. Kung maawit ba siya. Mmm, parang familiar ang amoy. May, may maganda siyang amoy actually. Okay yung amoy niya. Hindi naman siya masama. Not bad. So, ito rin yung aking skin ngayon. Isa na rin sa dahilan kaya hindi ako masyado nag-video or nag-film sa past few weeks is because yung skin ko parang na-irritate. And ngayon na parang naging down ako dahil ganun. Dahil ngayon medyo umoking na siya. As in, ang pangit nito dati. And yun, bibigyan ko naman kayo update yung mga, yung nangyari sa skin ko. Hindi naman sobrang worse. Pero hindi lang talaga ako sanay na nagkakapimples. So, ito nagsugat. Hindi ko alam. So, anyway, doon na tayo sa product. Kung saan saan naman tayo napupunta. It's because na miss ko mag-film. So, pagpasensyaan nyo na. Familiar talaga yung amoy. Pero hindi ko lang maalala kung saan. Parang meron siyang powder scent. Yun yung amoy niya. Tapos, para siyang serum. Yung kanyang, pagka, yung kanyang consistency or texture. Para kang maglalagay ng serum. Ayan, hindi siya ganun ka-sticky. Oh. 
hindi ganun ka viscous. So, para siyang serum type of primer. I'm gonna zoom you in guys para mas makita nyo yung sitwasyon ng aking skin. Para mas makita nyo if sobra ba yung pores ko. Dito ako maglalagay sa right side and the left side wala ako ilalagay. Ito na yung pinakasagad ng aking zoom. So, kung makikita nyo naman, medyo nag-aano pa kasi yung skin ko. Hanggang ngayon, para nag-rejuvenate pa siya. Meron pa konting peeling kung saan-saan. Pero makita nyo yung pores ko. Kitang-kita yung pores. Huwag tayong matakot sa pores. Kasama yan sa pagiging tao. So, redness and all. So, yun yung sabi niya, mawawala daw ang mamiminimize ang appearance ng pores. Mas smooth and tsaka yung matte finish. I have a combination skin type, oily on the T-zone and then dry to normal. Pero ngayon, normal yung mga cheek areas ko. Ayan lang, yung mga pimples lang talaga problema ko. Or actually, marks na siya. So, maglalagay na tayo. Baho niya. Parang naglalagay ng powder. Di ba from serum to ano din siya? Powder. Parang medyo, parang mafeel mo na magpa-powder like finish. Kaya siguro parang namamat niya. Parang magic cream. So, kulang sa akin yung ganyan kaliit because of malaki nga yung mukha ako. At saka lalagyan ko yung buong right side ng aking face para mas makita natin yung or makompare natin later on. Makita nyo this side parang medyo na filter niya. So, parang ayun naging soft siya o. Oh. Makita nyo dito o. Oh. Look at that. Pero yung sa pores... Parang hindi masyado. Hindi naman niya na-lessen. Pero parang, alam mo itong side na to, parang nagkaroon ng konting slight ng filter. Ito kasi parang mas kita yung pores ko dito. Parang gusto ko din lang yan. Pero kasi gusto ko din i-compare pag may makeup na kung which side yung mas tatagal. Yung may primer or same lang ang effect niya. Wala naman siyang claim na it will prolong your makeup. More on along lang. More on parang maano lang yung skin. Malesan yung appearance ng pores, self-control oil, and yun, matte finish. Kung maga, more on oil control lang siya. Not uh, prolong your makeup. Yun na may sabi niya, oil, pro, oil control pore minimizer primer. Now that we're done applying sa right side of my, right side of the, right? Talaga na miss ko mag-film. Now that we're done pag-apply sa right side ng aking face, Next is, maglalagay na ako ng foundation. I'll be using a, ano lang naman. Mm, not, I'm not gonna use yung sobrang matte na foundation. Kasi nga, tignan nyo naman, mas, in fairness, parang mas maganda talaga tong side na lagyan. I'm gonna use the Australis Stay Put Longwear Foundation up to 16 hours. Pero, ayun, na-review ko naman na to. And, yun, gagawin ko lang yung aking daily makeup. So, I'll be back. Okay, hindi sana ako mag-update. Pero ito, foundation pa lang naman tayo. Yung isang pump lang ng foundation ginamit ko. And, ayun, as you can see, mas kita yung uh, pores ko dito. Dito medyo talaga na-diminish niya. Na-lessen niya yung appearance ng pores. Pero, pag isusum mo, kitang-kita pa rin naman. Pero dito, mas kita. And, mas maganda yung lapat ng foundation dito compared to this side na Medyo parang nag-struggle ako dahil parang hindi smooth yung canvas. And this one very smooth dahil nga sa primer. So, ayun. Share ko lang yung thoughts ko. So, yeah. I'm gonna continue doing my makeup. And I'm done with my makeup, guys. Very simple. Ang nilagay kong foundation. Again, yung Australis. And then, yun ako concealer. Ginamit ko lang is Vice Cosmetics. Duo finish foundation na yung powder in the shade Putina Mez. And then, blush. Vice Cosmetics again in the shade uploaded. Ayan. And then, for the lipstick is the MAC lipstick in the shade Main. Okay, Main. Yung MAC Main. So, yun lang naman. And then, for the brows, of course, Evie Advanced Brow Kit. Yun lang naman ang nilagay ko sa friends lock ko. And then, of course, yung primer. So, yung primer, right side lang. So, right side ko lang siya nagamit. So, ayun. The time now is, wait lang. 
So, medyo late na ako nagsimula. It's already 1.25 p.m. So, na. 1.25 p.m. Ayan. So, I'll be back later for an update. And I'm back! It's now... So, ano nakita nyo? 6.40 p.m. 6.40 p.m. na. Pinalitan ko yung aking lock screen, si V or Taeyong ng BTS. So, anyway, ayan na po. Wait lang, parang sobrang liwanag. So, ayan. Okay, may pinuntahan lang kami na era, pero ayun, hindi naman ako masyado na initan. And as you can see, I'm gonna zoom you in, guys. This side right here, mas may oil build up compared to this side. And para mas talaga makita natin yung kanyang oil control, kailangan natin ng blotting paper. And I'm looking for my blotting paper in kung ano nila, guys. And for my blotting paper, I'll be using Pretty Secret then yung Bamboo Charcoal na variant. And ayun, lagi naman Pretty Secret lang din ang gamit ko when it comes to blotting paper. It's very affordable. And talagang nakakuha siya ng oil. So here are the two blotting papers and let's begin na i-blot na ating oil. So, ayan. Makita nyo, this this one is yung right and this one is the left. So, pareha sa man may oil build up. Mas, tingnan nyo. Halos the same. Halos same amount. Pero yung appearance, parang mas marami kasi dito. So, side by side comparison. So, halos the same. This one is left, this one is right. Halos same naman. Wait lang, tingnan ko mabuti. Yung, ano kasi siya, parang medyo nahaluan ng konting pawis. Pero sa oil, mas marami pa rin yung sa left compared to the right side. Pero meron pa rin. And also, yung patong ng makeup, mas meron pa din dito sa right side compared to this. Dito medyo naghulas na. Hindi naman yung sinabing makokontrol niya or I mean ma papatagal niya yung makeup pero yun nga syempre usually pag primer yun naman yung ginagawa so ayun dito mayroon pa rin yung foundation and yung powder dito halos wala na so in fairness I like it for 199 pwede na siya hindi na masama but then kung ganito na combination na skin type eh, ganun na yung oil build up in just a span of ilang hours. Paano pa yung sa super oily? So, kaya, para sa mga normal to dry combi, not for oily skin. So, recommended ko lang siya for my same na skin type and to normal and dry. So, pag super oily, super duper oily, ayun. Parang hindi nyo mabebetan dahil yung uh, oil control niya hindi masyado. So, overall, totoo naman, meron siyang smoothening effect. And also, parang may filter nga, diba? Parang na-soften niya yung side na to. And then, may matte finish talaga siya na effect. No, parang walang glowing something na parang dewy. And of course, yes, na-lessen niya yung appearance, of course. And additional to that, medyo mas long-lasting yung makeup ko compared to the walang primer. So, I think gano'n naman mostly. Pag smoother yung canvas mo, mas okay yung patong ng makeup. Sa claims naman niya, okay siya. So, for oil control, yeah. Siyempre, I think naman from time to time, lalo na sa weather natin, kailangan natin mag-blot, mag-tap-tap dyan ng pawis. So, pwede na rin siya for its price sa $199. So, thank you malos for watching. Sobrang nangis ko kayong pausap or ano, mag-film. So, thank, again, thank you guys for watching. If you're not subscribed yet, please do subscribe, like, and comment on this video. And mag-suggest pa kayo ng mga next na review ko. So, bye! See you on the next one!